In this session, I'm going to explain the repartition versus Colis transformations into the data bricks. So here I have a data frame. The data frame name is called DF. This DF having the multiple columns like a transaction ID, customer ID, amount and transaction date and region. So here there is a column called region. I'm planning to partitioning the data as a region wise. So the very first part, I'm going to implement the repartition technique. And the next, uh, I'm going to implement the Colis transformations. OK, so first I'm going to implement the repartitioning techniques. So here I'm trying to write the repartition technique and I'm going to provide the number as a file. So this is a variable name. So and a data frame, this data frame having the multiple columns. I'm applying the repartitioning technique and I'm giving the number as a file. So repartition means we can increase or decrease the number of partition. Let me take uh, one more couture code and to write the data into the my silver layer. The silver layer actually available into the data lake generation too. So this code actually main intention too is I'm going to write this uh, data to the silver layer. So in the silver layer, my intention is to create a folder. The folder name is called uh, repartition. Here I'm applying the mode as a overwrite mode to rewrite the uh, data to the silver layer. This is the data actually. I'm planning to reapply the repartitioning technique to the in this code. So here I just provide the number as a file. Okay, this is the variable. This variable I just take it and I'm planning to write this data to the uh, silver layer. I'm planning to create one folder. The folder name is called repartition. Let me execute this cell and we'll see the uh, data uh, into the uh, uh, data lake generation too. Okay, cell execution is uh, completed done. And let me go back to the silver layer. In this silver layer, so whatever we are executing the code, right? So there is a folder will be created. The folder, the name is called repartition. This one having the multiple part files. Okay, so whatever we are specifying that number, right? So based upon the number wise, here we are getting the multiple part files. This data actually split. Next to technique is uh, Colis transformations. So in Colis transformation, here I'm gonna uh, provide the same file number only. And uh, I'm planning to take uh, same uh, data frame, the data frame. I just applied the Colis transformation, same in silver layer. I want to create a one folder. The folder name is Colis transformation. Earlier we have a repartition, right? Let me execute this uh, one. So if I execute it right, uh, but earlier repartition, five part files will be created, but here only one part file will be generated. The reason Colis actually decreasing the only number of partitions in the data frame, but repartition actually increase or decrease the number of partitions in the data frame. So here, Colis transformations actually avoid the full shuffle and uh, repartition actually involve the full shuffle. That is the only difference between the repartition versus Colis.